Yo, so uh, I hit 100 subscribers a few days ago and I figured I might as well make a 100 subscribers special, so here it is. So I just want to talk to you guys, say, talk about the situate, what's going on, you know, hitting 100 subs, I want to make a video, talking about, also by the way, I didn't let people in Discord know, but I want to let you guys know that I um, sadly lost um one of my birds, and what happened is my brother left the door open, and my sister's cat got got one of them, unfortunately. But, um, anyway, yeah, I'm sad, but what can you do? And, um, you know, I want to talk about the state of the channel a little bit, too. So I've been uploading a lot recently. For the past month now, so within one month, got, um, 100 subs, which is good. I know, um, too, the way it kind of works is like a snowball, but I, the important thing for me, too, is make sure that the snowball is still going. So I know for a lot of channels, they'll have the snowball, and then all of a sudden they'll hit a stop. And either it's one of two things, right? It's either they give up and they stop posting, or they um they just keep doing the same thing and people just aren't liking it. The audience is as big as they thought. Now, um, for me, and the types of videos I make, I mean, I would say the two biggest content creators I've been watching recently, I would say, um, I guess I'd say inspired by a bit, is the right word to use, is um, first I would say Moist Critical. I really like his videos and how he just talks about stuff. So I do want to make videos like that. The only thing is, um, it's kind of difficult to come up with ideas. Obviously, something like this is pretty easy. And the other YouTuber is Asmongold, who I actually found during the summer. And he's actually the reason why I've been, like, reacting to videos, because I really like his videos. And it also changed how I thought about reaction videos, because at first I thought, oh, reaction videos, oh, that's what my sister watches. She watches Sniper Wolf, whatever. And so his videos, I'm like, wow, it's actually really interesting to watch him. I could do that. Right? I thought I could do a good job doing that too. So I figured, why not? And um, people have been liking them. Like, the thing that makes me happy too is that the watch time is up. Which means people are watching through a lot of the video. So it's not like people are clicking on it and then not watching it. So that's what makes me happy too. There are at least some of you guys out there who watch my videos. And then the two things too is um, the idea is I just post what I stream where I react to videos. So hopefully too, if someone were to come across my channel... There's plenty of videos to watch, and the goal is to they'll always improve, which I have been so far. That's the biggest thing is growth, right? I want to keep in mind, can the channel grow? That's what I really find important. Because right now, I'd say there is. I feel like even over the past month, I've gotten a lot better at making videos, even like thumbnails too. I use Google Slides to make thumbnails right now, actually, believe it or not. That's what I've been using. I don't really know what makes a good thumbnail. I'm trying to learn. I know YouTube came with the A-B testing, but I can't figure out how to use it yet. So hopefully, um, whenever I can start using it, I'll try and use that to help. But right now, just been making thumbnails to Google Slides, you know. Uh, just What I do for faces, too, I just pick random moments in the stream. I just crop them out in GIMP. So that's been fun. But um, I'm not going to keep this too long, I guess. I mean, I do want to go to bed. I mean, the other thing I've been doing... Usually Saturday's the day I edit, so I got most of the editing done. Not all of it. But the one thing I have been doing is I've been, I've been playing um, Super Mario Bros. U on my Switch. I just um, 100 percent Mario, the base game. And I want to do um, Super Mario Bros. Uh, Luigi U. That'll be fun. But yep, yeah, and again, the good thing is too is um, at first I used to stream on Twitch during uh, last year. And I would just play games. And I stopped doing that because I felt like it, there wasn't really, I wasn't really improving. I didn't really see a way for my channel to, my Twitch channel to grow. But at least on YouTube, I, I can see a path where the channel grows. And also, I'm much happier making this sort of stuff too. I still will play games and stream, sure. Sometimes I'll post a gameplay video on YouTube. I mean, also too, most of the videos I watch are people talking. I don't really watch gameplay anymore. So it felt kind of silly for me to make videos where I just play gameplay, because why would I do that? You know, I don't even watch that. So I didn't even know why people watch in the first place. It doesn't mean you can't make it, right? When the first people who made gameplay videos probably didn't even watch other people play it. They just posted it. But it was not It was something where I couldn't even understand why people would watch it. So it, And because I didn't really feel like I was improving... I didn't, I didn't really know what would make a good video, right? 
I've been happier with the videos I'm making. People seem to be enjoying them. Some people aren't. That's fine. You know, that's just what happens. You know, this is how the world works. All right, well, I hope all you have a great night or rest of your day whenever you watch this. Yeah, I hit 100 subs. Let's go. All right, hopefully I didn't make you dizzy. Did this make you dizzy, though? I'm actually getting really dizzy. All right, bye.